There are many challenges in today's industry for dairy farmers. Controlling and managing effluents is just one of them. Being situated at the head of the Carbon Up River near Kawaram Up WA makes Rodney and Nicole May all too aware of the importance of managing nutrient runoff. It's, it's Rodney May and uh, we live in the Augusta Margaret of the Shire and we've got uh, my, myself and, and my wife and, and plus one workman and a, a relief milker on the property. It's a rapid uh, exit uh, dairy, we, we milk twice a day. We milk around about 200 cows, but over 200 cows. And uh, on this property, there's 200 hectares, we actually operate the farm off of. Well, it's uh, a flood wash. We, we wash our yard with a flood wash, and, and then it uh, goes through a, a geared pump, or into a, well, virtually a sump first, and into the geared pump, which has got an agitator on it. And, um, and then to a sprinkler system which moves around in the paddock. We use probably about, uh, about five hectares so far. We've actually, there actually is outlets to, to do a lot more and uh, I suppose over time as it, it's uh, an, uh, plenty of effort on that area, we'll probably shift it from other places to, uh, to, to make a benefit there as well. Well the solids, um, with this agitator system, uh, it actually breaks it all up and, and uh, it just goes straight through the gear pump. We've gone to the, the drier part of the farm. Um, I'd like to go a lot further, but it's a lot more expense to, to pump the effluent further back in the farm. But uh, so far this is working okay. And, uh, and uh, as time goes on, I think I'll probably put more pipe in and go further, do more paddocks as well, because it, it is a, a good way of, of growing pasture without having to put any fertiliser, because the effluent is, 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 is really good. This coming summer we'll have soil tests and, to see how it's going there. Well, Dukerch uh, contributed 20,000 to the project, um, and then you know what else is, uh, uh, has been the own money. But but I think it was a worthwhile thing just just for environmental as well as um, uh, people downstream. The waterlogged areas and, and runoff that could finish up back in the Carbon Up River. So we decided to put it on a drier area, and and, and we hope to from then on expand it. With the area with our yard and uh, the holding area which the cows stand in outside the shed, uh, it, 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 it's, there's two tonne of nitrogen runoff off that and, and, um, and 300 of uh, phosphate and, and 800 kilograms of potash. So, so it's quite a, a big substantial amount of, uh, of effluent to, uh, or fertiliser which was going to waste before and uh, you can see the benefits on these paddocks now with the, the extra uh, on.